problem with this is this is all just one big ask and none of the defense contractors think that this is even possible to actually make except for one Lockheed because they have this new badass aeronautical engineer by the name of Kelly Johnson. If you don't know who Kelly Johnson is, he is the man that would later go on to be the founder of Skunk Works, America's premier top secret plane development program that is responsible for a ton of innovation like the SR-71 Blackbird and the F-22 Raptor. So Kelly Johnson and his crew are the ones that are gonna take on the challenge of developing the P-38 Lightning. And it becomes very apparent to them pretty much right out of the gate. It's not possible to do this with a single plane engine like most fighters have, so they're like, we're gonna have to have two plane engines. So they're like, fuck it, let's just take two fighters and slap them together. I mean, it works in checkers, why wouldn't it work in aerial combat, right? Jimmy, grab that fighter plane, bring it over here and king me. And just so we're all on the same page, a single one of these engines is more than enough to keep this plane in the air. With two of them, this plane is gonna be capable of traveling 413 miles an hour in level flight. To put that into perspective, that's roughly 100 miles an hour faster than any other fighter plane on the planet at this point in time in 1940. 